सो हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज अभय झा एंड टूडे आई एम गन शो यू वाट इज द रोल ऑफ द आल्फा पैरामीटर दैट्स द लर्निंग रेट इन केस ऑफ मशीन लर्निंग सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वाट इज द लर्निंग रेट एल्फा सो बेसिकली इट इज ए पैरामीटर विच इज यूज टू कंट्रोल हाउ फास्ट और हाउ स्लो द मॉडल लर्नस इन केस ऑफ द ग्रेडियंट डिसेंट अप्रोच सो वाट हैपन्स इज इफ the learning rate is lower than the optimal value then what happens that the number of iterations or the number of epochs used to minimize the cost function basically increases and it basically takes more time to do the same thing and if the learning rate is higher than usual then what happens is that the uh, error uh, generally saturates at a much higher value than expected so here on the right hand side you can see uh, this image where we can see that there is a local minima and there is a global minima so what basically happens is that if uh, the learning rate is too low it basically the model basically gets stuck at the local minima for most of the time and it takes longer time to reach the global minima and same is true uh, with the higher learning rate so if the learning rate is too high then basically the model does not stop at the global minima and that is why the constant error basically increases so now we will look at how to uh, test the robustness of the machine learning model so for that we have a parameter which is called the r squared value so basically this is a parameter which can be uh, used to predict the robustness of the model and basically what happens is the higher the r squared value the better is the machine learning model so this is one of the ways to show how robust the model is because the r square basically corresponds to the correlation between the observed outcomes and the predicted outcomes so and apart from this we can also use the f test which is a statistical test to check whether our hypothesis is robust or not so basically this is how you determine the robustness of your machine learning model thank you